Maybe if I was a little more desperate and um, a little less attractive and um, a corpse. Okay. Bleh. Bleh. Hello, welcome to another episode of Vampire the Masquerade Bloodlines. My name is Dexter. I know, I know, you're expecting someone else. You don't have to act so disappointed. Uh, let's go to Chinatown. Why not, right? I mean, here's our first, we're actually visiting Chinatown now. Um, I have a couple side quests that I wanted to do before I came here. Um, oh, it's even got smog, just like real China. If I don't wear it, she says, the air is smelly and dirty. It hurts my throat. Yeah, but that's the price we pay for a growing economy, says her father. Cool. What? What? What's happening? You could have warned me, man. And there's chickens? Oh god. Why is it where are the chickens? I'm not going in there. Where am I? What's happening? I'm confused. What is this place? This is um the FU syndicate. Oh yeah, classic. Classic. I guess it's food. Alright. Alright. Alright, alright. Uh what the hell am I supposed to do here? Um, I think, first of all, Chinatown. Nope, Hollywood, because I got them in Hollywood. I got the quest in Hollywood. Even though they're in Chinatown, they're activated as if they're from there. All right, so I need to get the, here I need to find the rabbits for the Nosferatu, and I have to activate a Chinatown hub for the Nosferatu network. Um, I have to go to a place called Kamikaze Zen. And I need to find Barabbas. I should go to Ming Zhao at the Golden Temple. So let's find some sort of. That's the Red Dragon. Uh, we're gonna keep our eyes out for the Golden Temple and a place called. Um, I literally just forgot it. Is it Kamikaze Zen? <laughs> First thing. This looks like a Golden Temple. I mean, it looks like a temple. Hello. <laughs> Not today. What? Hey you! You want your fortune red? You give me five dollar, I give you secret Chinese enlightenment. Only stupid person that want to know future. You are white. But I guess you could speak Chinese as a first language. Uh, you call me stupid? Oh, you tough! You gonna beat up old man? Oh no, it's senior citizen boxing champ! <laughs> Please don't break my other hip, Mr. Tough Guy! <laughs> Calm down. Pathetic, I'll, I'll let time take care of you, goodbye. Forget you! I give fortune to someone else. Fine, I'm leaving. I already had my fortune told. I'm gonna open a sarcophagus or something. Hello? This looks like a golden temple. It's right at the end of the, the street, so... I didn't see a sign, it just looks like a temple. And there's some gold? Ah, uh, okay. Sweet courtyard. Splash. Splash. This is like the only dirty water. It's like an inner zen pond or whatever. <laughs> the sewers are perfectly clear and then this is brown. What? Alright, I don't trust that. Welcome, kindred. And thank you for respecting our traditions by announcing your presence in our domain. I am Ming Zhao, High Priestess to the people of Chinatown. Can I get you anything? Tea, perhaps? Uh, no, I'm good. No, 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 I'm good. I'd rather learn a little bit about your, uh, your people. We are called the Kuei Jin, though you may know us as Eastern Vampires. It is a grave misnomer, I can assure you. Uh, why? Are you descended from Cain? <laughs> no. We are not simply some exotic Cainite bloodline. Uh, but you are a vampire. <laughs> 
We are supernatural. That does not mean we are like yourself. We are beings returned through the second breath for a purpose. Second breath? The second breath, our rebirth into the supernatural form. It is a spiritual awakening, not some lowly blood ritual meant to spread a despicable curse. Hey, I'm respecting you and your traditions or whatever. You could call me a sickness. That's mean. You're you're a mean lady. But we are similar. All right, I get it. You're angels and we're lovely bloodsuckers, right? Oh no, dear kindred. You misunderstand me. I mean no disrespect. Uh-huh. Yo, disrespect this. See ya. Bear horns. Uh, no. Uh, there, there we go. So as a mortal, you chose to become supernatural? Uh, yeah. No, we do not choose. But events of our lives can awaken dark spiritual energies. We are not born of the whims of another as the kindred are. Oh, okay. Do you have to be Asian? I think that is a yes. So why are we chosen to become supernatural? The reasons are as numerous as the Quajin themselves. Each is reborn with a purpose that they must find. Once their path is evident, they must seek to fulfill it even if it takes eternity. Okay. Uh, it sounds as much as a curse as the embrace of Cain. On the contrary, it is another chance for us to find our place in the universe. A chance for transcendence. We are not damned, not burdened with an ancient guilt, as in the legend of your biblical progenitor. Huh, okay. Speaking of legends, have you heard of the Uncarn Sarcophagus? Let's not bring that up right now, hang on. Uh, funny, do you guys actually buy into this stuff? Uh, I'm transcending out of this bullshit, see you later. Now, uh, speaking of legends, have you heard of the Uncarn Sarcophagus? Of let's, course. Let's, let's go there. The entire city is alight with news of its arrival and speculation about one of your ancient vampire grandfathers. <laughs> Are your that ears is glued evil, on? apocalyptic plot. Are those real? They don't look like real ears. Sorry I interrupted you. I just noticed the ears. Still noticing them. Can't 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 not see them now all right uh, uh i take it you don't believe in all that okay uh speculation about the evil ancient gram yeah we already we already know all that uh do you know where the sarcophagus is we seek it of course i have two of my best agents looking it could be a powerful bargaining tool who are they let me just say that i do not encourage you to seek the ankaran sarcophagus oh yeah i'm sure yeah okay yeah you're the one who's gonna get me off the trail by right, not encouraging me I have some more questions. What can I help you with? I'm looking for a Nosferatu. So, the great Nosferatu have lost yeah. an agent, have they? It was not by my hand, if that's what they think. Okay, but he was missing here, so any idea where he could be? I don't know where he is. Perhaps you should speak with Wong Ho about this. I'd rather speak to Wong Ho. To the right Ho, I mean. But, uh, okay. Nori, who's, who's Wong Ho? Wong Ho owns the Red Dragon Restaurant. He is a prominent businessman who has garnered much respect among his people. If something is amiss in Chinatown, he may know how to help you. I'll head on down to the Red Dragon. I grant you permission to operate in the Quajin domain. For now, may you find your path, kindred. How magnanimous. Thanks. You know, blush is supposed to go in your cheeks, not your eyes. Bye. Beep. buried it. I buried it like a dog. Like, what are they doing? Do they get the tuna out from here? And then they put it in the tins? Or do they feed tuna to the... You know, I... I I'm, do they feed tuna to the fit? Do you have... Can, do you handle it? Do, Chinatown's weird. Let's hit it the red dragon. Yakuza! Oh, it's but it's. Oh, hello. Just gonna ignore that. No, my problem. Uh, Red Dragon. Do -do -do. <sighs> sure, that that's not gonna be important in any way. They just stole a lady. It's 
you know, you, you've you read, they're probably Mongols, actually. That's what Mongols do. They, they uh, Celebrity Ash Rivers walks away from deadly crash. Nine lives? Ash Rivers. All right, what was I saying? Wait, did you just drop something? What the hell does that do? I just go up? You don't seem to care. Fishies. Is this what they put the two, two, they put the, oh, I can just hop over this. No, invisible wall. What the hell's this thing? Some sort of red dragon? That's weird, why they have that here? Hello, are you Wong Ho? Oh, you are. You are one, though. Hey, who wants a body massage? More like, yes, yes, yes. Let's roleplay. You be the scared village girl, and I'll be the sexy, sexy vampire. Uh, what? What? What is this? What are these questions? Uh, uh more like, yes, yes. Let's, let's roleplay. How about that one? Maybe if I was a little more desperate and, um, a little less attractive and, um, a corpse. Okay. Bleh. Bleh. Oh, I could just straight up murder this guy. No, I'm good. I'm good. Do 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 do. Nothing matters to me. I'm immaterial. Or these cups are immaterial. Somebody's not a material. Ah, oh, relieving my Skyrim days. Nice. Yeah. Okay, hey, what's um, up? Um, I'm sorry. Dinner service stopped a little while ago. But our lounge is still open. I'm here to see Wong Ho. Ming Xiao sent me. I'll get the elevator. Okay. Second floor, have a good night. Alright. You still offended? I'll take that as a yes. Oh, you were this lady. <laughs> okay. I guess I'll get the elevator then, lady. Beep. Beep boop pop. conversation and know what the other side of the conversation was. It's very quiet in here. It's a bit unnerving. Awesome. What else can I ruin? Alright. Mr. Canvist. I'm gonna make them think there's a ghost. Oh, I thought this would be... Never mind. Hello? Conference room? Beep boop. Is this, how do I get in here? Oh, there it is. They oh, you're Wong Ho. They took her. Who took what? You guys weren't that... Okay, first of all, the woman was kidnapped from here, but everybody downstairs seemed really calm about it. And you're up here freaking out? All right, who, who they, who, who'd they take? Kiki, my daughter. They grabbed her. They called and said, Wong Ho has meddled with Tong for the last time. Tong. This might not be the best time, but Ming Xiao sent me to talk with you. Ming Xiao? Oh, of course. Please forgive me, but as you can see, I am in a most terrible situation. I am Wang Ho, owner of the Red Dragon. Again, I apologize for my inconsiderate behavior. Yeah, whatever. We all, you know, I, I, your daughter's 
been kidnapped, so, you know, uh, you get to be rude to me once, but now it's time to get polite and calm, calm down a bit, okay? Your daughter's gone, you gotta get over it. Get a new one. I know some girls. Anyway, uh, no problem. What's going on here, Wang Ho? I'll try to overlook it this time. The Tong. What's going on here? A local street gang here in Chinatown just broke into my restaurant and kidnapped my daughter at gunpoint. The Tong grow more bold every day, and now they have my Kiki. Alright. Uh, usually, well, I, the, the Tong's kidnapped your daughter. Huh? Alright, uh, let's see. Um, usually it, it does take more than one Tong to, to, to grab things, usually. You usually need Tongs. That was the joke I was going for. I got a text. That means that I'm gonna have to be interrupted in a few minutes. Um, that make Daddy very angry. What? The, and now, huh? Sorry, I got distracted. Do you have any enemies? Why would the Tongs want your daughter? Uh, do you have any time for your family problems? I, I, I don't have any time for your problem, pro family problems. I have, to, I have questions. All right, that makes Daddy angry. Do you know where she? Why do I have to? Why am I saying that makes Daddy angry? Am I talking about me or him? Let's, let's, do you have any enemies? Why? Do they, why do they want your daughter? I am a man of some prominence here in Chinatown. I have many allies. There are also many who would like to see my demise. The Tong have chosen the coward's path, using my daughter as leverage against me. Uh, okay, sounds like I need to bring the wood. Do you know where to... What express... That makes Daddy angry. I need to bring the wood. What am I saying? Leverage for what? What do they want from you? Um, what do you have that tongues want? How's that? Uh, let's find out the story. I do not know. Oh, leverage for I will undoubtedly this. hear from the tongue very shortly. They will have demands, and then perhaps we will know more. All right. Um... So, listen, Wong Ho, I need to talk to you about something important here. Yes, I am very anxious to help you in any way that I can, but as you can see, my daughter, nothing else matters until Kiki is returned to me. I mean no disrespect to either you or Ming Zhao, but I cannot help you until this business is resolved. All right, and we're back. I just had to take a phone call. Uh, all right, um, let's see. Listen, Wong Ho... And then he said, uh, I mean, to respect, I need to do the thing. I got to help him with his stupid tongue, daughter, or whatever. Uh, uh, um, okay, where is she? No. The oh, tongue had many... Too. Uh, wait. Please That's excuse not... me a moment. That was your fake... Hello. Oh. Zhao. Huh? Magician. Yes. How did you... Of course. I see. Thank you, my friend. Your debt has been repaid a thousand times over. Yes. Of course. Goodbye. Uh, that didn't sound like Tong. Sound more like a guy named Zhao. Oops, I hit the microphone stand. So I gotta get comfortable, because I've got to do this. Alright, there we go. Hi. Uh, that didn't sound like Tong. That was someone who owed me an old debt. It has been repaid. I know where the tongue are keeping my daughter. All right, uh, just just tell me where, and somebody better call the coroner. Um, yeah, cool. Good news. Now I need your help in resolving another matter. Again, I am sorry, but until Kiki is returned, I cannot help you. Fine, I'll go squish these bugs. Where is she? Kiki is being held at the Lotus Blossom. A massage parlor here in Chinatown. If you bring her back to me, I will help you in any way that I can. Uh, all right, sure, whatever. But then we get down to business. Thank you. I shall wait here until you return. Strike fast. The Tong will not be expecting anyone so soon. Good. Uh, oh, sorry. Accidentally. Uh, see ya. Goodbye. By the way, the tong made a mess. Oops, I meant to close that. Oh, I probably should have been side when I did that. Yeah. All right, perfect. Uh, 
Bye. We're going to the Lotus Blossom. Oh my god, I'm gonna be sick. Go. Oh. Alright, bye. This whole, that whole, all, all that was weird. Everything that just happened. Alright, I got a couple more minutes uh, before I have to end the episode, but I'm gonna go try and get. Um, we have to find a place called Lotus Blossom, which I'm assuming is in this way direction. It couldn't be this place. <laughs> it's across the street! What? I just... What? Where, where do I want to go? Huh? Alright, well, let's not waste any time. I don't have a lot of time to record. I was thinking, can I jump in the window? Oh. Oh. I think this guy's stalking me. No, he just wants to visit the massage parlor. You go in first, dude. Just back off. You guys, you gotta... That guy's been rude to me over and over again, and he's the only one who dresses so weirdly. All right, combat zone, let's make a mess, baby. I mean, I'm not planning on making a mess in the massage parlor. That would be illegal. Hello. Hi. What's up? You might want to get out of here. What is this shadow? Is it your hair? Do I have to be sneaking right now, or...? Okay, would this just draw more attention? What did you guys do to this guy in there? Hey, what's up? My friend in the graveyard still wants you to go visit him. daughter that was kidnapped um, hey whoa I just took a wrong turn dude I can't read the Chinese signs I guess sorry I need to put my uh, forge on. give me a second here I'm reload reloading you can attack while I'm reloading Not allowed to tackle and reload it. I'll take whatever that is. Uh did I get enough? My fortitude's down, I gotta reload. Here's something else. Hello? It's me. Maskless man. Sneaking on in. You guys filming in here? Boy, that's not suspicious at all. Yeah, what's that? It's a hole in the wall. What's it for? Really tall men. <laughs> Trash can. This place sucks. What's this? Oh. Usually that's not what you mean when you're like recording sex. <laughs> A tape recorder. Alright. Yeah, nothing going on over there. Okay. Just shoot it. Lock picking is not sufficient, so let's find a key, I guess. Alright, that was easy. Let's 
seriously? What? I'm just film. Oh, we can listen to the demo night. Hey, what's up? Then you should be glad I'm not keeping in you in there. Also, you can totally breathe in there. It's just wooden planks. What? What? You could Are probably you a little fit tall out. for a tongue? A tongue? What? Tall. You know, like, not short. Jesus. All you thugs are the same. Stupid, stupid, and stupid. A thug? I'm not a thug. Are you Kiki? Man, the mouth on you. Are you Wong Ho's kid? Yeah, I'm Kiki. Who the hell are you? The Tong Welcoming Committee? Now you're saying Tong? Now that I've corrected you? You rolled Ben sent me to bust your ass out of here. Oh, I'm so impressed. What? Like you want me to thank you or something? In your dreams, asshole. Why didn't they kill you? Keep like, talking like that and I'll just leave you in here. Okay, okay. Man, you don't have to get all sensitive. I'm sorry, okay? Experience rewarded for. Did you get scared by my experience? Alright, that's better. Let's get out of here. You could have gotten out of there. The closet. Alright. Hang on. Let me get my gun out because it took it away from me again. Every cutscene it takes my gun away. Uh, I guess we're walking down here. Hey. Do we just go down? Or like what do we want to do here? I could just walk out the front door. What is this place? Damn, the stealth on this guy. Maybe if I move really fast behind cover, he won't be able to shoot me. Seriously, Kiki? Oh, this is just the way out. Ah, oh, I could've come through here. What's downstairs? Ooh. Can you give me a minute? to have some time alone with this guy. Hey, what's your name? That's cool. I can just look at you all day. Um... Nothing there. Can get myself some liquid demon seed. My favorite drink. Is this a sauna? Ooh, chests. Some chests I'm actually interested in. You know what I mean? Where am I? Sewers? That's cool. Let's head on to the sewers. I'm so Oh, she's gone. Alright, well, what? I guess I was supposed to go at the front door. Kiki? 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 Where are you? I think she might have went home. What? Nah. Alright. I got lost. Turn around. Um... I'm assuming she went home then. Hey, what's up? Nothing. Cool. Let's just get out of here then. I guess I could have probably snuck in there, but what's the point of buying all these bullets? I mean, I did get four experience points and then I just left. I'll scream. No, you won't. Maybe I'll scream. Was there something else? I'm here to see Second Wong floor, Ho. floor, have a good night. I know. Open up the thing. That's so mean. You make me sad. Look at the floor, because otherwise it shakes and I don't like it. Alright. Oh, hang on. Now look at the floor. Hey, Andrea. What? I think he is. Hold on, Andrea. Got another call. Hey, Serena. Did you hear about Joe? And yes, he is. Yes, he is. Yes, he is. I know. 
I was just on the phone with Andrea, and I was all, no, he's not. Yes, he is! Yes, he is. What's up? Ah, welcome, my friend. I owe you a debt of gratitude. You have returned to me my greatest treasure. Kiki told me how you rescued her. You are a man of great courage and honor. Thank you. That's why I did it. All right. Did you ever find out why the tongue took her? No. I have not been able to find out why they took Kiki. But I fear that it goes much deeper than the tongue. I don't care. For a long time, I have been trying to clean up Chinatown. It was a difficult job, but the community came Here's together, some janitors. and we started to take back our streets from criminals like the oh. Tong. Businesses reopened, families moved back into their homes. All right, the Tong looks stronger than ever. I mean, I just killed like ten of them, so... Uh, looks like you didn't clean the whole house. Yes. I thought that the Tong were almost gone, but then something happened. Their numbers began to grow, and suddenly they had a lot of money to buy weapons. With them followed the drugs and the violence. It is almost worse now than before. <laughs> Sounds like something is going tong. All right, all right. Um, th uh, someone must be pulling their strings. Who's bankrolling them? I do not know, but there is a change in the air. I meditate. But my spirit is restless. The words of the I Ching are dark and unclear. Everything seemed to change as soon as... Uh, what? I am sorry. I have said too much. Jeez, oh, okay, whatever. Okay, of course. What can I help you with? I'm looking for somebody who's gone missing. Who is this person? His name is Barabbas, and he's a business associate. Hmm. What else can you tell me about him? I mean, he's um, he's in surveillance technology. He's a computer geek. He's a real night owl, kind of pasty withdrawn. How about that? I see. I do not think I could find him for you, but I know someone who could. Jeez. All right. Where? His we'll name is person. Zhao. He is the man who called me and told me where Kiki was being held. Yeah, I remember. It was five minutes ago. Zhao has many connections. He owns an import-export warehouse in Chinatown. Go and see him there. I will call ahead and tell him to expect you. Uh, thanks, Wang Ho. Uh, I appreciate it. All right, and we'll do that in the next episode of Vampire the Last Great Bloodlines. Uh, my name's Dexter. Thanks for watching. Uh... Yeah, that's right. Look the other way. Look the other way after you look the other way, too. That's right. I've asserted my dominance. Alright, um, I guess we'll visit the warehouse and see what Chow's up to in the next episode of Vampire the Masquerade Bloodlines. And, uh, this time, actually, bye. Bye.